Hello, Rachel. Hello, Tony. Welcome, everyone, to Never Play. And this is Metal Gear Solid. What do you know about Metal Gear, Rachel? It's solid. I don't know. It's a difficult game. So I actually be playing the game, and I play this game multiple times. Multiple times. So like, how many? Times? It's one of my favorite PS1 games. This is a certified classic, and I want you to experience the craziness that is the Metal Gear Solid lore. Okay. So I'm playing this so you can experience the story and, and the reason why it's so infamous among the gaming industry. Hopefully there's nothing scary. It's not a scary it's game, don't worry. It's, it has wackiness, it has some drama. It has a lot of cool guy stuff. But I don't think that there's any scary stuff. Alright, before we start the game, let's just go through a few briefing videos. I'm not gonna go through everything. Just a couple. So you have some background on the mission that we need to do, Rachel. That's you. Or well, that's the main character. He's a naked dude right now. It's been a long time, Snake. Snake. I should have known you were behind this, Colonel. That's no way to greet an old war buddy, Snake. So what do you want from me? They're acquaintances. I just invited you here so we could have a talk. Invited? That's what you call sending armed soldiers after me? Sorry that's, if they were a little rough with you. That's a nice way to invite someone. But we've got a serious situation here. Right, so Only situation. you can get us out of it. I'm retired from Foxhound. You're not my commander anymore, and I don't have to take orders from you or anyone else. You will take these orders. I know it. The Colonel is sure. Excuse me. Who's this? Dr. Naomi Hunter. She's chief of Foxhound's medical staff and an expert in gene therapy. Are you military? No, civilian. I've been sent here from ATGC. You have a doctor Pleasure to here. meet you, Snake. A British Don't doctor. worry. This injection won't hurt a bit. What's the shot for? What's wrong? You don't like shots? Maybe it's like a compliance. Card. Snake, listen really? Up. Yeah. It all went down five hours ago. This is the situation. Heavily armed soldiers occupied Shadow Moses Island, a remote island off the coast of Alaska. What soldiers? Next generation <laughs> special forces, led by members of Unit Foxhound. So we got Foxhound with a group of soldiers. They presented here, Washington with a single demand, and they say that if it isn't met, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. They're gonna fire a nuke. A nuclear weapon? I'm afraid so. so they're terrorists. With you a see, demand. the island is the site of a secret nuclear weapons disposal facility. Foxhound hijacking a nuclear weapon? Now you understand how serious the situation it's very is. Very serious. You'll have two mission objectives. First, you're to rescue the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson. DARPA is a government agency. And the president of Arms Tech. Kenneth Baker. Arms Tech is an arms company. They're both being held as hostages. Those are some heavy-duty hostages. Fox Secondly, you're to investigate you whether or not the terrorists have the ability to launch a nuclear strike and stop them if they do. It might be a bluff, right? Any questions, Snake? Can questions? I haven't even said whether I'd accept this mission. Well, you can make up your mind after you hear more about the situation. So that's the mission, Rachel. Do you get it? So there's a group called Foxhound that took over Shadow Moses Island. And apparently, they're gonna fire a nuke if their demand is not met. What's their demand? Their You'll soon. Alright, sure, let's go to that. So what do they want, right? You were a former member of Foxhound. So and the what Colonel exactly the are they demanding? Former commander. A person's remains. Remains? Well, that's, that's right. A corpse. To be more accurate, cell specimens which contain the individual's genomic information. Cell specimens? Why would they want that? The terrorists need them. You see, these next generation special forces have been strengthened through gene therapy. Strengthened? You've heard of the Human Genome Project. That's right. They've been mapping the human genome, and they're nearly finished. Following up on this research, the military has been working towards identifying those genes which are responsible for making effective soldiers. They're tweaking. There are genes that do that? 
Yes. Make the best and using soldier. gene therapy, they're able to transplant those genes into regular soldiers. Gene therapy? I'll explain this part. There's the doctor With again. With gene therapy, we can remove those genes which we know may lead to sickness or disease, mm -hmm. and at the same time, splice in genes with beneficial effects, such as that? resistance to cancer, for example. In other words, we can overcome all sorts of genetic diseases, and at the same time, add genetic characteristics as desired. Okay. And so if you knew what genes were responsible for making the perfect soldier, you could implant them in the same way, right? Yes, we could. But it all depends on being able to isolate and identify those soldier genes. And in order to do that, it's helpful if you can study the genomic information of one of the greatest soldiers ever. So that's the bad That's the remains that they want. The greatest soldier ever, Rachel. Why not just give it to him? He's already dead anyway. Okay, but they're terrorists, so do you want the terrorists to have super soldiers? But right? will that still be useful? The man is dead, so is the yeah, style but still you're, useful? You're strengthening the terrorist group. Who knows what they can do if you can't stop them anymore? But it's a dead man, so I, the style should be dead too, right? Guess not. Alright, let's have one more video. Let's take a look at the organization that we're up against. Foxhound. So you get to meet their members, Rachel. High Tech Special Forces Unit Foxhound. Your former unit, and one that I was a commander of. You have history with it. An elite group combining firepower and expertise. They're every bit as good as when I was commanding them. So they're still around. There are six members of Foxhound six involved members. in this terrorist activity. Psycho Mattis, with his powerful psychic abilities. Yeah, psychic. Sniper Wolf, the beautiful and deadly sharpshooter. Sniper. Decoy Octopus, master of disguise. Guys, man. Vulcan Raven, giant and shaman. A giant. And Revolver Ocelot, specialist in interrogation and a formidable gunfighter. Gunslinger. Looks like a lovely bunch of folks. So Too bad we'll be meeting under yeah. these circumstances. And finally, in charge of them, Foxhound squad leader, Liquid Snake. Liquid Snake? Yes. That's right. And you're the only person who can stand against him. So somebody else is also named Snake, Rachel. <laughs> we'll find out throughout the game. So Metal Gear... Metal Gear Solid, this game, is one of the first games that was really cinematic with a lot of voice acting and a lot of chatter. It's like... A movie made into a game, you know. It's one of the first of its kind. It was very innovative back then. All right, Rachel, let's play the game. I'm gonna go on normal. Why not go for hard? This feature is about you experiencing the story. We don't want any frustration happening. All right. How were you able to? It's been a while since we last played the game, so. Like how, how did you play it? Was it by a hard mode? I might have played hard a few times, but not now. I'm very rusty. You can still change your setting midway through the game. Stay alert. Can you be through here? I know it. I'm going to swap down a couple of bothers. That's the good thing. The goons that hit you. The genetically enhanced soldiers. Yeah, but not the best soldier possible. Like I said, you should have powers. So help me. Give me powers. Octopus. They're, they're, that's a disguise, man. That's not really powers. That's the, their code the giant name. Guy. We don't know what his skills are yet. But he's giant. This is Snake. Colonel, can you hear me? Loud and clear. What's the situation, Snake? Looks like the elevator in the back is the only way up. Just as I expected. You'll have to take the elevator to the surface. But make sure nobody sees you. That's our first objective. If you need to, contact me by codec. The frequency is 140.85. remember that, When Rachel? you want to use the codec, push the select button. When we need to contact you, the codec will beep. 
When you hear that noise, You're press the select button. Talking the codex That's receiver good. directly stimulates the small bones of your ear. No one but you will be able to hear it. You, would you like Got that it. technology? Okay. I'm ready you? to go. All right, Rachel. So let's play Metal Gear Solid. So this is a sneaking mission. You don't want to be, you know, caught by soldiers. I have a ration our health items. They're good for you. We have a useful radar up there. You see it? That's a bad guy. He's sleepy, he's scratching. You can see his vision cone right there, the white thing on the radar. Anything, that's his vision. What was that noise? And I stepped on a puddle of water. He, he heard that, that's why he went to check it out. Hmm. What's that light? That's a no light. Better be careful not to get caught, Rachel. It's a sneaking mission. We need to go to the elevator, right? Right here. Campbell is calling. Snake, there's an elevator there you can take up to the ground. Nice. You'll just have to wait for the elevator to come down. You better hide somewhere. All right. It's not yet here, so we have to hide first. Uh oh. Oops. We don't want to be seen. <laughs> Let's hide here in this corner. I think it's a safe spot. Let's Yeah, but he's still doing his job. We're just waiting for the elevator to come down. You can hear it, right? Elevators make sound. So we'll just hide here. This game is very famous, Rachel. It was released in 1998. It's got amazing reviews. A lot of people look fondly to it. Including myself. The elevator is still not here. Maybe you have to press something. Just taking a while. Let's hide it. It says hide in this corner. Oh, it's coming. We're hiding. There it is. So we need to ride that elevator. I think it has a guy with it. You better be careful. There's a guy right behind me. There's a third dude, do you see him? Yeah, so how are you going to be able to get on the elevator? Right now! We need it! That's... Can you not see you at all? Nope! That's a sneaky... That's how you sneak it. You want to play the game? No. Why not? I don't think I can do that successfully. You can learn. You're riding the elevator. You, you you went in b via the water, so I think you're taking off your diving. To get more comfortable. Snorkel gears. You did not see it in the, vid the briefing video, but you cut your hair and dyed it black. Because Liquid Snake looks just like you. associate yourself with him that's why I... but when while you're here you're trying to be like him right? no that's not Act your mission like... your mission is to find out if they have capability to launch a nuke and to rescue the two hostages This will not be a perfect playthrough. I will make mistakes. Okay. I'm not an expert of this game. Okay. So just to preface that. Sure. So what's the last time you played this game? It's Snake. Five years I'm in ago. front of the disposal facility. Excellent, Snake. Age hasn't slowed you down one bit. How's that sneaking suit working out? I'm nice and dry, but it's a little hard to move. That's a doctor. Bear with it. It's designed to prevent hypothermia. This is Alaska, you know. Take it easy. I'm grateful. If it weren't for your suit and your shot, I would have turned into a popsicle out there. 
an anti-freezing peptide That's snake. Part of All the of the genome soldiers in this exercise shot. are using it. I see. I'm relieved to hear that. Already tested, huh? By the way, how's the diversionary operation going? Two F-16s just took off from Galena and are headed your way. The terrorist radar should have already picked them up. To distract them. Oh. While you sneak in and do your mission. So this is a one-man mission. Behind D. Colonel. What's a Russian gunship doing here? Let's see helicopter. I have no idea. But it looks like our little diversion got their attention. Now's your best chance to slip in unnoticed. to make our way inside the disposal facility. Yeah. You think I gotta get caught? There are only 18 hours left until their deadline. Uh -oh. You've got to hurry. So wow, he must be crazy to fly behind in this kind of weather. It's a different girl. Who's that? Oh, sorry. I haven't introduced you two yet. This is Mei Ling. She was assigned to us as our visual and data processing specialist. She designed your codec, as well as your Soliton radar the system. Contact her if you have any questions about either of them. And of course she has to be Asian, right? <laughs> nice to meet you, Snake. It's an honor to speak to a, a living legend like yourself. No comment. What's wrong? Nothing. I just didn't expect a world-class designer of military technology to be so... So what? ...cute. <laughs> You're just flattering me. No, I'm serious. Well, I know I won't be bored for the next 18 hours. Come on. Like I can't her? believe I'm being hit on by the famous Solid Snake. But uh, I'm surprised. Snake. You're very frank for a trained killer. Looks like we both have a lot to learn about each other. Yeah. I'm looking forward to learning about the man behind the legend. But first, let me explain about your right, Soliton radar, radar system. This is actually the like third The bright dot in the middle the is you, Snake. Ginger. The red dots are your enemies, what do you mean and the blue the cone ginger? shape represents yeah, their field of vision. Dots. Be careful, Snake. The genome soldiers have highly developed senses of hearing and vision due to their gene therapy. Make really, sure huh? you don't let them see you. First, I want you to infiltrate the disposal site and look for the DARPA chief. That's the first hostage. The DARPA chief was injected with the same GPS transmitting nanomachines as you. He should appear on your radar as a green dot. Get whatever information you can from him about the terrorists. If he's alive, that is. You think he's still alive? Or did, yeah, did they kill so. the first hostage? Snake, your radar isn't affected by the weather, but if you're discovered by an enemy, you won't be able to use it. Yes, it gets jammed easily, I'm afraid. Yes, it's all made from currently Maybe existing she just technology. Sucks at her job. You won't be able to use it in an area with strong harmonic resonance, so be careful. We'll be monitoring your movements by radar, so contact us by codec anytime you want. Got it. I'll call if I'm feeling lonely. Seriously, Snake, we're here to back you up, so call if you need some information or advice. I'm also in charge of your mission data. Contact me if you want me to record your current status. My frequency is 140.96. It's a dedicated frequency for saving data. Don't forget it. She's a safe person. Remember, except for your binoculars, you're naked. You need to arm yourself with whatever weapons you can find. I remember. First, I'm strip searched by Dr. Naomi here, and then all my weapons rubber, are taken yeah, away. Briefing. Imagine yourself put in that position. Well, if you make it back in one piece, maybe I'll let you do a strip search on me. I'll hold That's you to that, Doctor. Great. By the way, sorry to disappoint you, but I did manage to smuggle uh -oh. out my smokes. How did you do that? In my stomach. Thanks to the shot you gave me that suppressed my stomach acids. <laughs> cigarettes? How are those going you to help your you? Cigarettes you never inside know. your stomach. That, you know, that's how drug dealers bring in uh, drugs to airports. If you want to get in, there's the front door. It's the fastest way, but there's too much risk of being spotted by the enemy. I can't just knock on the door and ask them to let me so in. How do we get in, Rachel? Uh, there's one sentry on the left and one on the right. They're armed with five five sixers and pineapples. Do we go in the front door? Maybe there's a back door. But I bet the back door will also have 
What about the air duct near the door? There should also be a duct on the second There's floor. There's ducts we can crawl through. That's just crazy, but yeah, maybe that's how they really do it. I can't see yeah, it from here. I can't see it from here. So you gotta move closer? I'll let you decide the best COA. I'm counting on you, Snake. Alright, let's get through this area before we call the episode. Uh, of course, it's not gonna be through the front door, because that's just crazy. It's rational, but I'm full. You can only hold on to two. Is it always the same item? Yeah. There are guys in there. Let's kill this dude. <laughs> I just killed that dude, Rachel. I snap his neck. Is there an item here? There, I got my first gun, Rachel. So calm. Alright, that's what I wanted to, to get. That's bad. Do you see those green cones? Those are security cameras. Uh, oh, those are not. Yeah, the white cones are the. the oh, dude. A a I think he's sleeping though, right? There, let's kill him. A surveillance Ooh. camera? Oh, the camera saw me, Rachel! Get out of here! I got, I got stuck there. What's wrong? Snake. I think I'm gonna make Snake. a count if you die or never. All right, sure. You can keep a counter in your head. So, what's the current count? Episode. How many deaths I do we have? I wish you won't have to. I won't have to use it. Oh. You know, we're just. Just shaking off the too. cobwebs. Let's kill this. Wait, let's not kill him yet. Because yeah. we're gonna be seen by the camera. That's how I got caught. The camera saw me choking that guy. Maybe don't pass through that area because there's a camera. Okay. Let's or find another area. Then. There's also a camera there. This is a different area, right? A surveillance camera? Alright. We have to be careful here. There's an item here. But now nah, that's not get it. Might not need it yet. I'm trying to make my way to the second floor. So let's see what the best route is. Maybe it's on the other side. Alright, this should be the route I should have taken earlier instead of that one. If you go underneath the camera, you're not gonna be seen. There's a dude up here. Uh oh, it's coming. Is he gonna go down? Alright, good. You can choke him to death! Uh oh, still alive. Okay. Yeah! I snap his neck. Because snapping necks is fun. Have you tried it? No. Right. Somebody's calling, Rachel. That base must have some kind of ventilation system to recirculate the air. There should be air ducts around there somewhere. It. They must need a lot of power to run the base. There's probably a diesel generator somewhere. And since generating electricity requires oxygen, there must be exhaust That's openings for that too. You're not gonna believe this, but they shot down the F-16s we were using as a diversion Whoa. with a Hein D. Remember the then we got a message here? from Liquid. He said if we try something like that again, he'll launch the nuke. Snake! Hurry up and get in there. That hind will be coming so back soon. So flew the chopper and destroyed the the, the, the the diversionary planes. Yeah. And now he's very angry. They triggered him. They triggered him. But it was necessary so we can sneak in. And we are able to sneak in. I think we're, what, we're, what are we going to see here when crawling? It's pretty dark. Dust. Cockroach. So Spider, far, so far we don't see any creatures. This is a different frequency. Snake, this is McDonald Miller. It's been a long time. Master, what are you doing here? I quit being a drill instructor, so I moved out here for some peace and quiet. I'm in retirement, just like you. Once in a while, I still help so train the Alaskan the scouts. Passing on the skills to a new generation. Train of huh? sorts. <laughs> Campbell told me about the situation here. I thought I might be of some use. 
There's no one I'd rather have in a foxhole than you. Well, I know lots about survival in a harsh environment. I've lived in Alaska longer than you, so call me if you have any questions about the flora or fauna out here. My frequency is 141.80. Right. So you, you know, the, the, a lot of numbers. <laughs> the numbers. So how do you call them? Like going here? Don't worry, <laughs> they actually listen down, so you don't have to memorize it. So if we, oh, sorry, I called master. Snake, you've got to think. Your mind you is your most statement? dangerous weapon. If things are getting too complicated, try to simplify your thoughts. You can also try calling Campbell for advice. Maybe you get an answer in this place. Well, so we, if we have any questions on the environment, the flora and fauna, we call master. Maybe if we can eat the various rats here. Yeah. What's down this hole, Rachel? Huh? I moved the dark machine to the cell in the first floor basement. What about the vent shaft cleaning? They just opened the vent covers. I'm about to start spraying for rats. First floor basement ventilation so shaft. We really have to Shut really those covers as soon as they're done head. spraying. Also, keep your eye on that woman in the cell. There's a woman. Don't get careless now. Woman in the cell? Huh? Did something happen? There's an intruder. Really? He's already done three people. Oh, we killed those he's dudes, killed Rachel. three people? Yeah. Say he's using stealth, too. Stealth? I killed two. There's an intruder besides One. me? Anyway, I want you to increase the security detail on the chief. So somebody else is in here, Rachel. Who do you think it is? Let's just crawl through the... Crawl... Crawl through the other side. Yeah, but the vent can only go one way. This one is locked. We have to find the exit. The open, uh, what do you call that? The vent, the open grate. Have you ever tried crawling through a vent? That's where the air conditioning comes from. We have another call here. Press the action button to drop down. That's how you do it in real life, Rachel. You have to press the action button. Alright, I think this is a good place to call it. She arrived inside the disposal facility. Let's first go through this call. Use the elevator to change floors. There should be a cargo elevator that you can take down somewhere around there. Try to find it. Alright, we need to find another elevator, but let's do that next time. Let's call Mei Ling. You found out where the DARPA chief is. With his nanomachine transmitter, he should show up as a green dot on your radar when you get close. Try to find him. Alright, let's see. And something else happens with Mei Ling whenever you stay. Come on, Snake, you can do it! Oh, not this time? Alright then, you let me down, Mei Ling. Let's try that again. You found out where the DAPA chief is. With Same thing? Mei Ling, you let me down. Maybe we'll see it next time. Let's try it again. Come on, Snake! Ah, Alright then, Mei Ling. I guess we'll see what I taught me about next time. Maybe you'll get. Nope. What do you think about the game so far? It's an action game. It's not really. A, it's a stealth game. Can kick dudes? I haven't done that. All right. We'll, we're gonna go rescue the DARPA chief next time here in Metal Gear Solid.